Hey there friends, Foster the Canadian here, and we're back in NHL 19 Hockey Ultimate Team doing another pack opening. This time we've got some Gold Rare Player Packs, another Ultimate Pack, and then a Team of the Year Premium Pack, or, yeah, Premium Pack, the 50k pack, so we should hopefully be able to find something from this. It's been so long since we've gotten a really great pull, and man, if you don't have a stacked team, it's so hard to compete in competitive seasons. It's an uphill battle every single day. And John Tavares might help with that, actually. Might a little bit. I, I'm pretty stacked as far as uh, my forwards go, to be honest. But a defenseman I can still use. I just, I need some help. Something. Because I only play players I personally pull from packs, so I have to get them from the packs in order for them to be useful. If I don't get them from the packs, I can't use them. And that's why it's been such an uphill struggle every single game. I, I mean, they're stronger than me, the players are faster than me, and I still have to figure out how to win. But hey, scheme over team. There's a reason I still have a winning record, and that's because if you know what you're doing, you know how to play the game, then you're going to do well regardless. I just don't want it to be that hard every single time. And then if you get someone that even slightly knows how they actually are playing with players that are, you know, 96 and up, there's no chance. And another offensive team of the year. Wow, that is a weird... How old are you? Why are you so pale? How... Uh, there's so many questions that I have about that player. Rhett and Reinhardt. Fake. Fake player. But yeah. Uh, I need something to give my team a little bit of an edge there. Just something. Eddie Larson will not cut it. Carl Klingberg and Sergei Popov. I'm sorry none of you are going to quite cut it, but... That will contribute to the next pack opening that we do, so that's always good. Uh, the final pack of the video is the ultimate pack. This is the Big Daddy pack. This is the one this video is all about, and I'm excited to see what we can get here. So far, the ultimate packs have let us down. Like, time and time and time again. 30 players, 6 of them are guaranteed rares, 17 are guaranteed golds. At the very least, that's a lot of resell. But still, I don't want to have to resell for another video. I want something this video that I can be like, okay, we won. Something tangible. Magnus Pearvi, okay. Anders Bjork. Sammy Vatanen. Let's see if we get anything over an 80. Oh, man. Okay. Istvan Safran. Okay. Hampus Lindholm. There we go, an 81. I guess they sure showed me. I guess they sure showed me. Zach Hyman. Lucas Klock. Joe Thornton. Jumbo Joe, he shaved the beard. It doesn't look that way anymore, sadly. Uh, Lawrence Pilat. Can't... That's a name. Okay, Chris Thorburn. Scary, scary guy. Dadanov, who's going to be probably a much better card next year. He's had a great season. Oh, gee, who? Talking about great seasons. We got a couple of cards here that next year are going to be awesome. Hey, we got Care Bear again. Okay. Okay, Carey Price, Michael Matheson. Oh man, so far I feel like the best thing that we're getting is actually from our rerolls, which I should be able to do one more reroll, no matter what, after this. So let's let's go reroll. Let's see if we can get anything just from that final pack. Okay, I didn't feel like that was quite enough for a video, so we've got four more rerolls, two more team of the year packs, and now we are into community team of the year. I'm excited. My boy Brock Besser has made it to team of the year yet again, two years running. Uh, pretty happy about that. Hopefully we can get ourselves something good here. Going through the re-rolls first, because you never know. We've gotten a few good re-rolls in the past. Even last video wasn't too shabby. Uh, usually we don't see the, the top tier cards in the re-rolls, but it's still good to go through them. Do your re-rolls, kids. Do them. Make sure you get them out of there. Uh, you might get a Charlie McAvoy. You might get a Primetime Crosby. You never know. It's kind of a toss-up with the re-roll packs, but... That's not what you came for this video for. You don't want to see David Backus. Uh, you want to see the Team of the Year pack. So, mini Community Team of the Year. Five player items. One is an NHL player item and a chance at a collectible. I'll take a chance. Uh, right now, we actually have probably the best collectible set possible. Uh, and I'm actually really excited about it. So, I'm going to be stocking up as many of the Community Team of the Year collectibles as I can. Uh, so, I can get a video out there for you guys. That bronze will not help with that, but we do have 50,000 coins, so we're going to go to the store. We're going to get one more of the premium community team of the year pack, see if we can get anything out of this. Again, I'll say this over and over a million times, uh, this is the pack we got team of the year, Derek Roy, and I'm kind of like, I heard a story once of a dog that found a pie in a bush. 
and every time his owner walked him, he had to search that bush for 10 minutes to see if there's another pie. There never would be another pie, but because it happened once, the dog was just so, like, that was the magic pie bush. This is the magic team of the year pack, so I'm just gonna be, like, drawn to it constantly because I got a team of the year once from it. And we got another collectible! Okay, so that's looking pretty good. I'm happy with this pack just as is now. Uh, and a Patrick Line. Okay, so we'll send those to my collection. Now, I do want to go over one thing really quickly here. Uh, and that is, I'm going to go to the sets here. If we do take a look at the Community Team of the Year sets, what we will see is that I currently have 5 out of 18 for a guaranteed, guaranteed Team of the Year player. I've been stocking uh, up on these, I've been grinding, I've been doing my challenges to make sure I can get them. It's kind of hard balancing work and doing the challenges with that, but I've been doing it. We have 6 out of 18. If I cannot complete this in the 6 days needed, then I'm going to turn what I do have into the Team of the Year role set. Now this has a 20% chance of getting a Team of the Year player. Right now, we've almost already got 2 chances of that, so 40% chance of getting a Team of the Year player. I know odds don't work exactly like that, but that's not bad. That's better than any chances that we've had so far. Uh, so I'm looking forward to it. I, I Ideally, I would obviously like the Community Team of the Year choice pack. However, if I do have to settle, I will settle for the uh, four Community Collectibles, 20% chance Team of the Year player. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed watching. Until next time, this is Foster the Canadian, saying see ya.